What's the education system like in China? Chinese children over six years old are allowed to enter primary school. After six years education here, they spend three years in junior middle school. This nine-year education they receive is called National Compulsory Education, which requires all school-age children to be educated free of charge. Following compulsory education, Chinese students will sit their first important lifetime test, the Senior High School Entrance Examination, Zhang Kao. Based on the results and personal choices, 87% of students step into senior secondary education, and 57% go to regular senior secondary schools to gain cultural and scientific knowledge, while 43% enter secondary vocational schools to be trained with skills for employment. In most provinces, those who enter regular schools will be divided into classes focused on social sciences, Chinese, English, mathematics, politics, history, and geography, or natural sciences, Chinese, English, mathematics, physics, chemistry, biology. Whichever one they choose decides what they will be tested on during the college entrance examination, Gao Kao, their second important exam. The total point of the examination is 750. In fact, there are six foreign languages that can be chosen. English is the most popular. Whether students enter the university they prefer depends on their final scores and the enrollment mark of the university. Therefore, Gao Kao is greatly significant to Chinese. That's why most senior students in high school work hard to prepare for the examination under huge pressure. However, China has implemented historic education system reform. Gao Kao will adopt a 3 plus 3 model. All subjects require higher level Chinese, especially in traditional Chinese culture. Chinese education points to comprehensive personal development oriented education. Gao Kao tends to select examinees on the basis of majors.